Hi, my name is Wasa Sise. I'm Ivorian and I'm a third year Global Challenges student. I've always been interested in environmental conservation, but I actually never knew that you can make it a passion and a work. I am a huge environmental activist. I just love everything green. So what I'm focusing on is trying to create more and more sustainable ways to live our life every day. So what I try to do is, for example, um, move from plastic straws to bamboo straws, make sure that uh, we are more um, sustainable in the fashion industry and all of that. I remember that I received the Wangozi Institute competition literally by mistake, right? So people were just sharing them. Um, the ALU community shares a lot of different opportunities. So a friend and I, we decided, that, oh, you know what, we'll start writing. So we worked together and then we came up with an amazing work, an amazing piece of work that I submitted. And it was talking about how uh, we should, as an African leader, we should be thinking about using natural resources more sustainably. And when goes into to just gather literally leaders, the topic that they gave us, if you were an African leader, is the same thing that they did. They brought together presidents, former president, actual president, prime ministers, uh, and those were people you always see in the TV, but you could never be close to. But I was close to them, and I had a picture with them. I shake their hand, and then we were like, yes, like now we're probably equal, or this is where I will be. And I was really excited, because it feels nice to know that not, not only you've been making, I mean, doing research, but also that your point of view is valued, and whatever you have to say is something that and people can apply. Oh, other project I've been participating in was an amazing and super hectic one. It's called the Unleash Lab Innovation. So this year, uh, the 2019 Unleash Lab happened in Shenzhen in China. And the goal was to gather all the uh, young leaders all across the world to come up with really interesting solutions to tackle directly uh, challenges of the SDGs. The role that I, I intend to play at some point, and which really I hold super deep to my heart, is to create that representation in all type of institution. West Francophone West Africa is not really present in any debate and talk about conservation. So I see myself being leading, for example, the West Africa Department for the UN Environment Program, for example. But like the Climate Action Department, I see myself there because I believe that we need not only women, we need young people, young women, bright people, people motivated and ready to do the job, right? And that's that's me in five words, literally. As we're talking about the ALU journey and everything, I know people can be really skeptical when they're outside, but ALU is the place where you learn. Like you learn about yourself, about what you like, what you don't like, and who you want to be. And the, the means are here to help you become that person. So if this will be the video that should encourage someone, yes, that's what I'm saying. You, you should all just come.